What's good YouTube? It's your boy Jordan. Welcome back to a new video. Today's video, I'll be showing y'all how to sell on Depop. Alright y'all, so for step number one, is taking your pictures. When you're taking your pictures, you want to try to keep the same background when you're taking your pictures, you feel me? You don't want to change it up because on your shop, you want it to look professional. You want to have the same pictures for all your listings, you feel what I'm saying? So... <clears throat> Make sure you try to keep the same background. Uh, and when you actually take the pictures, make sure you get like the whole image. You feel what I'm saying? Don't be too close. Don't be too far up. You feel what I'm saying? Make sure you take a picture of the front, back, tags. And uh, if you can, get somebody to uh, like a picture on body or somebody to model it for you. And please, before you send your clothes off, bro, wash the clothes before you send them off to them, bro. Unless it's brand new. If it's brand new, then you know what I'm saying? You feel me? They can do that. But make sure you wash your clothes. You feel what I'm saying? Before you send them off. Uh, but yeah, front, back, tags, any flaws, and a model picture if you can. Those are like the main pictures that you need to take. But I cannot stress it enough, bro. Make sure you keep the same background. You feel me? When you're taking your picture. Uh, telling you, you're going to get a lot more sales like that. Trust me. You feel me? I'm saying. All right, y'all. So now I'm going to show y'all how to take the pictures. So you want to make sure you get the front. And while you're on the front, go ahead and get the tag, the uh, the brand tag, and the watch tag. Uh, make sure you get the size. Make sure you get any flaws like this, for example. This is a flaw. This is not the original uh, zipper uh, piece that goes on there. So make sure y'all take any picture flaws. Then you want to flip it over to the bait. It's not going to be perfect right now. I'm just giving y'all an example. Make sure it's, it's good quality pictures. Then you want to make sure you get the back. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, I'm going to be showing y'all how to list, list your items later on in the video. So y'all make sure y'all stay tuned and watch the whole video. The second thing y'all want to do is, bro, y'all want to go cop y'all a measure, a, um, a measuring tape, or whatever you want to call it. You feel what I'm saying? Make sure y'all get y'all one of these, bro. I think it's like, they get it for like $2.99 or something. I think I caught this for like $4.99. It was a set. It came with like some other stuff, but it's probably can get it cheaper than that. But make sure y'all get one of these, bro. Because people gonna ask y'all for measurements, bro. And I just go ahead and I just measure it before they even ask me. You see what I'm saying? I put it in the description. You see what I'm saying? Before they even ask me, I take pictures with it sometimes. So they can know if it fit them or not. You see what I'm saying? Yes. And also, copper scale too. That's that's a tip I wish I would've known before I start selling. Copy your scale, bro. It could be a full scale, or you can go on Amazon and get like a um, a scale for about $20. But a full scale would be cheaper. That's a cheat code. I ain't gatekeeping y'all. You know what I'm saying? All right, y'all. So the next step uh, is actually listing your items on Depop. So I'm gonna put my phone up here with the audio. So y'all can see exactly how I list my items. All right, y'all, I'm on my phone now. So what you want, the first thing you want to do is you want to go ahead and open deep up. And I was already on Let me go back so I can show y'all. So you want to click on this little plus sign with the circle around this as well. Then you want to go to the top with the camera icons and go ahead and um, select the photo that you just taken. I like to do the front, back, and then the tag as a third uh, photo. Alright y'all, so next I'm going to show y'all how I pack my orders, you feel me? First thing I want to do is y'all want to go on Amazon and y'all want to copy out some of these shipping bags. You feel what I'm saying? These gonna come in handy, bro. You can get like a hundred of them for like ten dollars, bro. Instead of going to the dollar store and getting them for like two dollars for one, you can get ten. For, you can get a hundred for like ten dollars. So this gonna help y'all in the long run, bro. 
these bags. The next thing y'all want to go cop, bro, is going to be a label printer, bro. Trust me. You're going to need this, bro. This, bro, once you get this label printer, you don't even have to leave your house to ship packages no more. You see what I'm saying? You can print it right here. They'll get the label come. Boom. Mailman come. Give it to the mailman. You can even schedule a delivery for the mailman to come knock on your door and he can get the package. You see what I'm saying? But make sure y'all think about hopping a label printer. But yeah, that's two things that y'all gonna need um when shipping these orders. Um shipping these packages from Depop. And I'm currently using Depop shipping. Uh I heard a lot of people um it's easier and you save more money using power ship. But um unfortunately I don't have no skill right now. My uh, old skill broke, so can't ship through power ship right now. I've been using Depop shipping. Right now, I'm gonna show y'all how I pack an order. Somebody did buy some jeans, so I'm just gonna go about showing y'all how I end up um, packaging that order. These are jeans that uh, he ended up copying. So, somebody ended up copying. So, I just take the jeans and I take one of these bags. Yeah, it's gonna be a long have to hit so I'm gonna have to speed this up, bro. You feel me? All right, y'all. So I got it in the bag, y'all boys. So now all you gotta do is just take the little plastic little wrap off that joint. You make sure you grip it tight so it won't get stuck. I like to put my knee up right here. Fold it down, let all the air out. Seal it down tight, you feel me? Just like that. You know what I'm saying? And there you go. You got a nice little flat surface to lay down your label. All right, y'all. I'm recording off my phone. So uh, in order for me to print out the label, the video is going to stop. But I'm going to get back to y'all boys once the label is printed out. You feel me? As y'all can see, I went ahead and printed out the label. And now all I got to do is just uh, put it on the package. So I'm going to do that real fast. All right, y'all boys. That's pretty much it. Uh, with this, very simple, very easy. All I got to do is just drop this off at the post office, the local post office, or just hand it to my mailman. And he'll get it shipped out for me. I will be dropping an advanced tutorial showing y'all how I source my items. Uh, how much, like, how much, like, in detail, like, how much I pay for the items, how much I sell them for, uh, how profitable I am on the items. Like, my deep shop, I'm gonna be showing y'all all that. So, y'all boys, stay tuned. Make sure I hit that like, comment, and subscribe. Pretty much wraps up the video. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'm gone.